I wish I could write. Tie words together with bows of lyricism and watch them flow with rivers of rhythm. Say them with all the eloquence of forever and all the consequences of never after. Maybe if words flowed from my lips like tears from my eyes, I could alleviate this all-encompassing, ever-present, so dark and heavy, oppressive silence. Maybe then I could leave this town of rocky crags made of broken dreams and fallen promises to loves and lovers that would last forever but then never did. Go in search of myself and find the ones who know how to write beautiful words. Who know how to speak with the sharp beauty of the violin like low-lit cheekbones, the undertones of the cello like a stalking jaguar, the quiet comfort of an acoustic guitar and the, all the joy of a light piano. Who can speak with all the passion of the bass and the power of a beating drum that makes your heart leap into your throat and have it stay there. While all around you, words batter against your skull like the pounding river against the rocks at the bottom of a waterfall. I wish I could find the words to describe the majesty of the morning sun instead of the hidden pressure of air over a pit. I wish this wasn't part of my blood system, as much a part of me as the brilliant Scots and the gorgeous Filipinas from across different oceans, brought together by a common dream that was crushed by genetics and infected by cynicism. How did my ace of hearts turn into an ace of spades? How did my joy of hours ago turn into this? Tar, sticking to the bottom of my feet, trapping me in place and stopping me from running, tumbling, falling towards the border. Where, when, and how did these ropes come to bind my arms, keeping me from flinging a hand out in search of help? Gags of words that will never be spoken crush my lips and tell me no. Be silent like the wind on a mountain. Be silent as the mountain itself and watch beauty pass you by, but do not participate. Observe, never touching. Do you dare to serve the magnificent turn of events that shape the earth as the ocean shapes it? You are not the ocean. You are not the wind. You are not the river nor the rain. You are not. I wish I could write. Feel the gag of unspoken melodies fall from my lips and sing a pretty little heart out. Broken and bruised by genetics, but healed and cared for by angels of the earth, not of the air. Watch as the ropes loosen and reach for a hand that will brush off the quicksand and empty the water from my lungs and fill them with air. Feel the tar slip away and make a mad dash for the ocean, for the seas of opportunity. I leave the entropy behind me and look to the sky, because it's not dark. The clouds will have parted, and it will be clear. It will be filled with hope and joy and so much feeling that all oppressive, dark and stormy weather will be long forgotten. And there, and there, on the boat that will take me to destiny, will be the words that will have finally found them.